Like, uh, scoreboard on my bullshit like Jordan is Up like an ornament, cash in the audience Money bags on the way like I own Right now, not later, right now I'm taking you to Amsterdam Where rapper Biggie Dago got wet up And he didn't make it So for those of you who think you're gonna go to Amsterdam Burn some hash, talk trash And nothing's gonna happen Something is going to happen Now Biggie Dago Now Biggie Dago, I got one question for you You had at least 30 the 45 mans that were down in your music video. One man had on a ski mask, looked like he caught a couple bodies. Everybody looked like they were down. Where were all those mans when Goonies rolled up on you and asked you, what's that stuff you were talking on the internet? And then started dumping shots. Where were all those mans? <laughs> And some real talks, Biggie Dago, I'm not trying to disrespect you in any way. But your 253 bills talking trash on the internet. You didn't think for one second, what if a man caught me at the store trying to buy a blunt and tries to chase me down with a Blix? You get caught lacking, we a Blick you at the store. You didn't think what are you gonna do? It's like chasing a turtle. You didn't think for one second, what if man then peel the corner and you had to hop two fences? Two, three bills can't get over that fence fast enough, dog. But you're on the internet talking all that trash and didn't think about what's gonna happen when man's find your ass. So I burnt a two paper spliff, went to go see what Dr. Umar was saying to get on some righteous vibes. Peace and Pan-Africanism, peace and Pan-Africanism. Good Garvey day from Guadeloupe to my continental Africans. According to Dr. Umar, he got this text message from this woman with this picture. The man uploaded to IG. Now his comment section was going wild. They are saying she is not a snow bunny. She's not a thotty. She's not a proper, she's not a sweetas, she's not a battery ting, she is a rice bunny. Now I don't know what that's supposed to mean. You guys come up with these things way too fast and I can't catch up. Rice bunny, does it mean that that's proper? Or is the comment section just trolling and we're not using that? Rapper, Chicago rapper, Duty Low. The man's not just rapping. The man is rapping about his life. Take a key and took her to the O. To the o. You get caught lacking, we a blick you at the stove. Duty low, off of Adderall. <laughs> bro, you tripping. <laughs> Give me oh, some yeah. BC powder, too. That's the guy. Yeah, yeah. I'm off the Adderall, that bitch got me. I'm off the Adderall, that bitch got me. <laughs> they ass tweaking. Where the bags at, bro? Let me get to it. like Duty Low dropped his location. Everybody knew he was at the gas station. Duty told the gas station employee, look, I dropped my location. There's probably gonna be a couple goonies. They're gonna pull up and start wetting up the store. I'm gonna drop the low in a the minute. They're gonna pull up and fire this bitch down. I gotta hurry up and get out of here. <laughs> they know the location. I gotta go, buddy. <laughs> I'm just talking shit out much. Send a motherfucker to Jesus. In the store, in the store, in the store. Take a key and took her to the O. To the o. You get caught lacking, we a blick you at the store. Gas station employee's like, what? Duty's like, yo, don't worry, I got that. If man's come through, I'm gonna do what I gotta do right here in the store. And the gas station employee's like, yo, dog, you're not allowed to wet up no man's in this store. And Duty's like, actually, you can look it up right now. In the store. It's stand your ground law out here, right? No, Send them up. That's, that's like that. It is stand your ground. It's stand your oh, it? Yeah. Look it up right now. What you want to bet? I bet a thousand to your hundred. It's a bet? No, it ain't. I can look it up. Look it up. I bet a thousand dollars to your hundred. And it's ground law. 
uh, blew a motherfucker right to Jesus, they play with me. I'm just an innocent bystander. I'm not here to be able to go to sleep. I don't get no fuck out. I don't want to go to sleep, though. Look at him. Say, I, as I, I know my shit. I told you I'm going to blow a motherfucker to Jesus and stand, and stand right here. And I still don't know what happened until my lawyer come. I don't even know if she is. This is. I'm going to be the one that's running. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So he looked it up and he found out that, yes, Duty Low and his homies will wet up some mans in this store if Goonies walk in. So the question is, right after Duty Low left, did that employee stay at the gas station like nothing happened? Or did he put up a closed sign and quit because he thought that Goonies were gonna come through and just wet up the place? Bro, I'm not working at no place where I know Goonies are gonna come and wet up the place, dog. Most videos, the most stories, you're watching Worldwide Spotlight back-to-back -back videos according to MyMixtape.com. This man right here uploaded this picture to his social media and wished Birdman a happy birthday. Yo, my G, you couldn't put on a shirt before you uploaded that picture and wished the man happy birthday? Now, Birdman, I'm just gonna say what everybody else is thinking. Do you know this man? And if you do, we know for sure that something zesty is going on. Now, it looks like this man is posting a thirst trap, trying to get Birdman back. I don't know. I'm just a reporter. Does Birdman know this man or is he just a random man trying to get some attention? Rapper, ASAP Rocky. Uh, word around, word around, word around town. You the one doing all the murder around town. Pulling up, shooting, leave the bird downtown. Disrespected Rihanna last night. I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to be the real. And now we know for sure that Rihanna is just a plow to ASAP Rocky and it's nothing serious. Last night, ASAP Rocky was out with Selma Hayek. They were so close. You would think that they were together. The way Selma was looking at ASAP Rocky, I guarantee the man plowed that more than 10 times. Yo, B, she's not just sitting in the chair beside him. She's all up on him, hand on shoulder, getting close. Rihanna, you are not exclusive at all. Selma's all up on your man. Now, if you go back in history, you will see that ASAP Rocky and Selma Hayek been hanging out. You're telling me ASAP Rocky's not this? At the end of the day, Rihanna, you need to just hold this L. You came into the game. You didn't get a ring. You know what I'm saying? Your baby daddy's out there with Selma Hayek. Whatever. All you got to do is dust yourself off and try again. The ASAP Rocky, he doesn't like you like that. If he did, he would have gave you a ring a long time ago. To him, you're just a plow. And on some real talk, Selma, you better watch your back. Cause if Rihanna sees you, I guarantee. I pulled out that gun. Rum, ba, ba, bum. Man down. You watch a worldwide spotlight. Like the video. Share the video. Buy a T-shirt. And yes, if you buy a T-shirt right now, I'll sign it. If you don't want to buy a T-shirt? Buy a badge for one ninety nine a month, and I'll see you in the comment section. More videos, more fire, more stories coming up next. Go live, spotlight. Pull up. You got one round in you, then man's gonna be on the floor. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt. Then man's gonna be on the floor. Then man's gonna be on the floor. Then man's gonna be on the floor. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt.